coming past the pond that's been dug out three times. Fake snakes to keep the big white birds away. New plants where the plants got killed. And then we keep moving. The trail's not fast enough. But this is kind of coming around the corner. And the dogs are following, so we have to stop for a minute. These are Hawaiian plants. Um, they're trying to bloom. They don't get a lot of sun because of all our rain. Um, those are the best kind of dogs right there. They don't <laughs> pee or poop. When we come around here, with the porch is the favorite pooping place and peeing place. And then we're going to move quickly up here. She walks fast. We got over here we got some beautiful begonias. They're very old. They're really pretty. We got a a mulching blade in our stream bed so it finally runs instead of dribbling around. It's been super. Artificial turf. Easy to clean up. Coming up here. Some of the mob is following me. Cheryl's pitiful garden. Our poor lemon tree last year produced 200. This year, that's all there is. A couple twigs. This crepe myrtle came from Fredericksburg. It's really pretty color. Very pretty color. Okay, stop. The never ending hibiscus. He just got neutered yesterday. This is Mr. He's an idiot. This is Fancy. She just got spayed. This little girl is trying to gain a little weight like Cheryl. Looks <laughs> about the same. Sneeze, lose your pants. This little guy had to have an eye out, but he's doing really good. He's very cute. His name is Timba. Over here is Hopi. She's our 16-year-old. Olivia Grace reminds me of Bitsy. I love her. She stayed too long. She's mine. Rosa. Rosa is a foster. She's a little afraid of us still, but doing well. Bobo. Then there's Bobo. Bobo's a pretty boy. Yeah. He got turned in. He was beating up on the girl at the house. Yeah. Uh, then there's Archie. Archie's been here five years. He's a mess. He's a genetic mess. For our roof, that's our crepe myrtle now. It used to be about 10 feet tall. What a messy mess thing that is. Oh my gosh. Every day. The courtyard is slammed. Okay. Now, we can stop that. You ready? You can notice Cheryl's new shirt I got her. I think we all could take the L out of the letters there. But anyway, that's her new shirt. 
And if she sneezes, their pants will fall down. But we're ringing the oxygen cylinders bells. Very cool sound when it's really windy. Ring there. What are you ringing? So, yeah. That's, that's all we have for this one. More to follow. So she's 15 or 16. Right, so there, go ahead. She came with us. She's been to North Carolina, Minnesota. No trips lately. Mostly Uber for her now. Foxy. Then there's the beautiful fox dog. Come here, Foxy. Come here. There's a beautiful girl. Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, most of it. This this is Tinkerbell. The vet called her a baked potato on the table. Hurt my feelings bad. So she had to go on a diet. Um, she really doesn't. Does sort of look like a baked potato. Um, Thumby! Over here is Thumby. She stays here because she pees on everything. Get that baby. Get your baby. Beat it up. Oh yeah, beat that poor baby up. Beat that baby up. We may divide these up. Don't forget Granny. There's little Granny in the corner here. She had to lose her eyes, but she just loves laying by Cheryl's desk. She's very comfortable, very happy. She's a good girl. Don't forget Mr. Mr. Sampson. Oh, Sammy's here. He's very shy, like Rosa. We're working on that. This is Jasmine, the mean dog. Meanie, you let her mean dogs lie. Yeah. Yep. That's Winston. He's got really bad mange. He can't mix with anybody, not even the people. We have to gown and glove if we handle him. But he'll get better. So we'll see how we're going to divide it up a little bit. Or if you can even hear me talking when we're talking. There's the puppies! And in here we have the puppies! The puppies, they came to us one day old. They're five, almost six weeks old now. They're little crazy dudes. Then we got four boys and a girl. We got them. This is Mama Gypsy. Mama Gypsy. Where's, what are you doing with my baby? You got my baby? Yeah. They're all about bothering mom still. Although they do like to flop around in the kibble dish. couple of weeks they'll be ready to get go to the vet and then get adopted. We've had nothing but puppies all during COVID. Litter after litter. So hopefully this will be the last for a little while.